What just happened? That's my dress. That's my dress. And, and that's my dress. And that's my dress. And, that, and that's my dress. Look, babe, if you want to go shopping, I'll call tomorrow and have them close the store for a couple hours, but it's a little late right now. Those are my dresses! Those are my dresses! They will be tomorrow at 10 o'clock when they open. I'll even throw in a purse. Don't you get it? These are my dresses, and I designed them. Ricardo Bragini stole my dresses! He copied your entire line? Every detail, every stitch. Victory, breathe. I can't. I feel like someone Botoxed my whole body. Have you ever met with Ricardo Bragini, shown him your sketches? Well, even if I did, it wouldn't matter. Because Ricardo Bragini is a brand. He has 12 people designing for him. And then, on top of that, he buys freelance. You have your sketches, right? Well, I can't find them. I can't find my pulse. Calm down. You need to call your lawyer. Her lawyer can't do anything. And she'll call my lawyer. But designers aren't protected by copyright laws. What? Why? Because... Clothing is not considered an art. That's why stuff like this happens all the time. That's why designers are so secretive about their work. Really? I thought that was just an affectation, like wearing your sunglasses inside. That was one time, and you know I had a sty. All right, look, I think that you should just call him and speak to him directly. I have called him. I called him three times, and I left him messages. But I don't think he's going to call me back, because no one would actually admit that they stole your work, especially when you don't have the evidence to prove it. Well, then you need to turn this place inside out and find the sketches. When does Roy come in? Okay, you know, you guys, just go. I can do this. I, I'll figure this out. I can do this by myself. Go. Where are you going? 